Mike Cardano with Roto Experts and the Fantasy Sports Network, and I'm here to put the odds of winning in daily fantasy gaming in your favor. It's my job, it's what I do, so sit up straight and pay attention or risk losing your money to those who are. Now yesterday, we had rain all over the place. Today, not so much. And we should be able to pick up players in all games without that being a concern. Now, if you've been following along, it may appear to you that I've been using San Diego Padres starter Ian Kennedy almost every time he pitches. The reason it seems that way is because I have. Now, Kennedy continues to get favorable matchups week after week while racking up strikeouts at a rate of 9.5 batters per nine. He throws at Petco today against the Rockies with no Tulo in the lineup, and they've already packed it in as they now have the worst record in all of baseball. And with nine pitchers commanding higher premiums on FanDuel, he's once again a daily fantasy bargain. When the Detroit Tigers traded for David Price, giving them the last three American League Cy Young Award winners, they were prematurely awarded the American League Central Crown by pundits and baseball enthusiasts across the country. Now the problem here, of course, is they had to then go out and play the games. Now, since the trade, the Kansas City Royals have been on fire and Detroit has been in free fall, with the Royals now residing in first place by a half game. Today, Detroit will throw right-hander Buck Farmer against the Pirates as he makes his first Major League start filling in for Rick Porcello. A fifth-round pick of the Tigers in the 2013 draft, Farmer has made just two starts above the single-A level. Now, I expect a free fall for the Tigers to continue today as the Pirates' left-handed hitters feast on a kid who has been thrown into a pennant race and will be like a deer in headlights. You're going to want to stack Pirates' left-handed batters in your lineups today. Using the highly scientific statistical method of going by what I see, I noticed that Bryce Harper has been having much better at bats of late. Staying on the ball and hitting it hard the other way, including two home runs in his last five games, is something that to me is a sign that the worm may have turned and that there is a hot streak in the cards. He faces Bartolo Colon today, and at just $2,900 on FanDuel and $3,600 on DraftKings, the risk-reward is at a point where I will use him in all formats. I continue to see feeble attempts to beat me in Daily Fantasy from our viewers. Where's the fight? Where's the heart? If you think you have what it takes to beat me in Daily Fantasy and you want to challenge me, follow me on Twitter at Mike Cardano and shoot me a message with the site you want to play on, the amount of your cash game challenge, and your favorite charity. And I'll choose one of you at random each day. Now, if you win, you get to keep the cash. If I win, I will donate the winnings to the charity of your choice. Good luck in your Daily Fantasy gaming today, everyone, and I'll see you right back here tomorrow on the Fantasy Sports Network.